Adventure day. Uh, we are about to go see Ian. Uh, you guys might remember Ian from WSC where Sal walks in and stuff like that. Uh, but he's actually going to get himself another Sakyank tattoo. Uh, Sakyank tattoos are like a traditional Thai uh, tattoo that's been uh, become extremely popular over the past few years uh, because of people like uh, Angelina Jolie and Michelle Rodriguez. So. Taxi going to get at uh, my main man Ian over there. His tattoo. What are you getting today? Uh, I don't know yet. The uh, shaman's gonna choose one for me. So, what is a Sakyang tattoo anyway? Sakyant are an ancient style of tattoo where basically you visit a shaman, uh, you talk about your life values, and he suggests one that embodies everything that's important to you. You already got one, right? I've got three. Damn, I thought you had one. <laughs> what do they do? Like, what kind of, like, they give you, like, superpowers or? Uh, some of them are for protection. Uh, one of them, like, for instance, warriors used to get them and uh, they would say it, it would stop a bullet mm -hmm. or back then, I guess, a spear. Uh, I wouldn't recommend testing that. <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't either. Uh, other ones could be enhancements for things that you're passionate about if you love uh, art or if you are a businessman and you want like luck in your business or luck in love you know stuff like that so what are you hoping for today uh this one it's a little challenging the, the two that i've got already or three uh two is is actually part of the same one it's for compassion and empathy to try and <laughs> no <I'm> just my <laughs> <No, I'm just> <laughs> Uh, no, it's to be more empathetic to people. Dude, dude calls me condescending, motherfucker. <laughs> and uh, no, it's, it's things that I think are important in any relationship. If it's uh, with business, if it's with uh, friends, if it's with a lover, uh, those are all things that, that only make that better in your life. And uh, so those are things that are important to me that I want to improve in my life. Uh, and the other one is for protection when you travel. Uh, I've been traveling for 20 years, almost non-stop. And uh, yeah, it actually has a pretty heavy significance to me. So that was the first one I got. Today, uh, there's a few things I want to talk about. I'm gonna see what the shaman suggests. Um, I'm gonna talk about uh, being a better leader. Uh, I'm an entrepreneur, I own my own business, and I want to treat my staff the best that they can, uh, that, that I can. Um, yeah, a, a few things, but the, the main focus is really just going to be on... Ian, so you want to explain what you just got? So this is a custom-made offering uh, and before you get a sakyan, you have to put one of these things uh, in offering to this statue that they, they honor called uh, the Rusi or the Hermit in English. And the Hermit is probably one of the most important figures in all of Sakyan. He's like a, a monk that went into the forest, learned from the animals, uh, learned from nature and develop this style of, of Sakyat as far as mythology goes.
Checking out the finished piece. Right, let's see. Oh, okay. Let's expose. Oh, oh, nice. And what's the gold leaf for at the top? Uh, sort of like karma, you know, like by giving something of value, mm -hmm. it makes you open to receiving something of value. Oh, cool, cool, cool. So, what does the tattoo mean? This one. Uh, it's it's a little complex, but basically Buddha's covering his face. Mm -hmm. uh, that's supposed to help reject any negative energy that comes into your life, so that you can basically like uh, forget about the small stuff and focus mm -hmm. on the big stuff. Uh, and don't, so don't sweat the small stuff. Right? So since we live here, this was just kind of like a um, informal, impromptu kind of tour, like a little visit thing. But if somebody wanted to kind of organize this trip through like your company. Like what would that cost? Like how long would it take? Stuff like that. How would uh, they find you? Uh, WSE Travel. Hold on one second. On, on. <laughs> FYI, Ian's a good friend of mine, but he also owns a tour company that I fully support. <laughs> All right, go ahead. All right, well, any social media channel uh, uses the same thing at WSE Travel. All right. Uh, the WSE stands for Where Sidewalks End, mm -hmm. and it's because we do things a little off the beaten path. Uh, this particular experience we offer in cities all over Thailand, Bangkok, Ayutthaya, Sukhothai, Chiang Mai, Chiang Rai, uh, looking at stuff down south as well. We uh, charge about 250 US dollars, but that includes a tattoo, uh, that includes a licensed guide, all your transport from your hotel, even a little meal afterwards. Cool, cool, cool. So what uh, form of uh, social media do you prefer people to go to? Uh, Whatever works best for you, really. Cool, cool. We got Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. Cool, cool, perfect. All right, thanks, man. I appreciate it, brother. Thank you, too.